Back with Williams behind him. Second and ten. Trying to throw, has to throw as he's going down, and it's intercepted by Mac Wilson. <laughs> Quinnen Williams, I think, was the guy that hit Mond, and Alabama's got it just like that. I don't this is the best look I think we have. Right about there, I thought it might After hit the ground. But watch him. He moved it. It's an interception. When it was about halfway down, I saw behind him. They might go for one right here. And he will. Much like the championship game. Touchdown. The same guy. Safety was in position, but watch Smith set him up and then go around him. Watch the spoof, sets him up, and then again, a perfect throw and a better catch. How about that? 30 yards, one play scoring drive. How much fun would it be playing for Alabama when you... We're inside the 10 without a return. End over end kick. That's not going to inside the 10 at the one on the catch. And it's Henry Ruggs. The starters play special teams, so one of your top wide receivers makes a pretty good catch at the one-yard line. And play-action pass behind him, just like that. Mon out in the left flat. It's good for a first down. And I like the look of this kid, Kendrick Rogers, a big receiver, 6'3", 210, and that quiets the crowd. Here early, second and nine. Mon pro is complete, another first down. And that one's to Courtney Davis, and they'll move it out to the 25. How cool is Kellen Mond? Mond in trouble on the inside. This time he does run for it, and a whole bunch more. Kellen Mond, he's still going down to the 15-yard line. Well, he knew what Gary said, so he took off for 54. Maybe he wanted more space. This was a called quarterback draw. Designed quarterback draw. Runs through one tackle, and no one was in the middle of the field. Alabama was playing their combo packages where they're comboing outside playing man, and all of a sudden, Kellen Mann runs through a winning Williams tackle, and there was nobody in the center of the field. Mond has a look at that Alabama front. Play action. Pressure from behind to the end zone. Touchdown, AM. Yep. And it's Sternberger, his yep. fourth touchdown catch of the year. You affect the safeties with play action pass. You hold the linebackers and you go to the tight end. Alabama has not played against a lot of tight end offense. High game at seven. On second down, play action down the middle, complete. Josh Jacobs all the way to Aggie territory. Doesn't seem fair that Alabama can run the RPO offense. Third down and six. Tonga Valoro fires out in the flat, complete first down. Henry Ruggs still going. Holy cow, did he take a hit? Two, Matabuke, it comes back from after rushing the passer. One, for a potential Donovan targeting. Wilson. Yep. Oh, Donovan Wilson, is it tar targeting or not? That's what they're looking at right now. A lot of people have talked about. After review, it was targeting against number six on the defense for Texas A&M, using the crown of the helmet. That's a 15-yard penalty, automatic first down. Unteachable skill. I've only seen one other guy in my college days do that. He's going to keep it on this one. And he's heading to the first down. And he's got it. Around the 10-yard line. Who's the other guy that has that uh, it was vision? A fellow by the name of uh, at Purdue. Purdue Breeze. I don't know. I kind of lost track of him, though. Damian Harris. Running over Aggies. He might make it to the end zone. He's got a first down at the two-foot line. Tie game. Damian Harris got him down here to the two-foot line. They fake it to him. Tiger Valero is going to cruise into the end zone. Touchdown, Alabama. Nobody over there. And I'm coming back. That was pretty impressive, getting off the mat and doing that. Yep. Mond on second down. 
The pressure got to him this time. He got drilled by Isaiah Bugs. Let's see if that AM defensive line can get in there and help this team make a play on Tua. Tua play fake, quick throw. Waddle again. Spins away from one guy. Second guy is going to bring him down. Nice open field stop. Caper Smith made the first hit, and then Leon O'Neill holds on another freshman to make the tackle. Oh. Empty backfield. Damian Harris now is going to trot over there next to Tonga Balor. Tua's flipping it to him. Damian's got nowhere to run. They lost more yardage. Nice job by the Aggies defense. Sure Here comes a punt, and they're going to get good field position. Yeah. Mon going to go deep. Oh, that's going to be interference. Gonna be interference. Yes. Uh, Trayvon Diggs. And it's not a bad 15-yard penalty that time by Trayvon Diggs. He was beat. Mond, quarterback draw again and again. He's into the secondary. Didn't get the first down, but another good run before he's brought down by Xavier McKinney. Gaggies, but he got him close enough on third down to try to convert here. Third and two. Play action. Mond is going to keep it again. Not going to get there. Lost a yard. Christian Miller ran him out. Brad, you're going to get an earful. Believe me, I've been there. Seth Small trying a long one. 53 yards, and he got it. Big, big kick to put Texas A&M within four. 8.50 remaining in the first half. Najee Harris behind Tagovailoa, who loads and fires. Deep middle, complete. Jerry Judy in a first down after the 45. They go in a hurry on first down. This time the flip is out to Irv Smith, the tight end. Irv Smith. He's a matchup nightmare for teams, and he's still standing up. Big game. First down, Alabama. Big play that he featured here all those years. And again, Alabama goes with tempo, and Najee Harris for about four yards to the 30. He lines up in 11 different spots to be accounted for. Wide out screen to Judy, puts his shoulder into Derek Tucker and takes him out of bounds for a first down. Down and one, Damian Harris. They fake it to him. Tonga Valoa steps around the first man. Now he's gonna keep it. And he just got there. Got that left foot right at the mark. No review. They got it. They fake the pitch. He lofts it. Caught by Hinches. Touchdown. Tuscaloosa, where the tide leads 21 to 10. Kellen Mond in trouble. He's going to run out of it. And he's got a bunch of green in front of it. Looks behind him and gets out of bounds around the 40-yard line. Another big run by number 11. One of 92 on the ground for Mond. He'd like to get some in the air. He's got some here, Travion Williams. Travion to the 35. The pitch. Williams with Jennings trying to track him down, but he got away. And he's still going inside the 20. <laughs> Big run. I thought he was going to drop the pitch. And I thought that might. Four wideouts and the tight end and an empty backfield for Mon. They're going to come. They're blitzing. Here they come. Quick throw is batted up in the air and almost intercepted. Mac Wilson, I think, got a hand on it. Alabama lines up as if they're playing their combo coverage, but that time they were coming after the quarterback. This should be a chipper. A 33-yard field goal attempt to try to make it a one-possession game, and it's up and it's perfect. And with 324 remaining in the first half, the lead of Alabama's is cut to eight. Smith in motion to the slot. They do. Third and seven. Wide open is Damian Harris, and he's still going down the sideline. Damian Harris all the way down to the 20. The play on one of the biggest plays of the day for this a and defense. 52 yards on the pickup, and now, wow. Tyler Valoa tucks that one in to Jerry Judy, and he broke three tackles to get another first down. Tua wants to throw. Got his man. Hedges again. Touchdown.
was beat on the play. He didn't make the tackle, and that time he let that tight end pass it by. A&M's got two timeouts with 109 remaining in the half. Quarterback draw again, Mond, and he lost the ball, almost lost the ball. And that run is getting him close to 100 yards on the ground in the first half. Uh, by just running your quarterback, he's got to be able to be effective throwing the ball to him. He's going to run it again behind Travion Williams. Broke the tackle. Does a nice job to get it where he got it, out to the 42-yard line. Mond, pressure from behind by Miller. Throws deep and intercepted. Coming back the other way, Patrick Sertan. And the freshman with a big play on the defense for Alabama. You want to see a five-star? Let me show you a five-star. Jermaine, Alabama following the interception. Tonga Bailoa going to throw short across the middle, but it's Henry Ruggs who's on the run. And down inside the 30. Timeout. Take a timeout. Get one more throw if you want it. Or the tight end Smith is in a slot on the right side. Tua going to come back the other way to the end zone. Incomplete. Intended for Devontae Smith. He looked to the right, then came back and to the left. Oliver had pretty good cover. He was. The kick on the way to end the half is perfect. So sophisticated was just as happy with that field goal kick as anything else in the first half. <laughs> Six defensive backs on the field. Blitz again. Mon's got to get rid of it. He's going down before he can get rid of it. And McKinney, who just had the penalty, comes up with a sack. This time play fake. Roll the other way and fire. Complete. Judy. First down. Nobody else could. That's who Tui reminds me of. To a one. And this time is Irv Smith. Smith inside the 20. First down, Alabama. And Tua just keeps adding to his yardage total. Yeah, they use a 42 yard pickup. And now the play fake and out in the flat to Smith again with a stiff arm. Shed one. Got it down. First and goal. Two. He reminds me athletically of O.J. Howard, doesn't he? The way he moves. Manage you. As good as two is, I guess. Exactly. Jacobs going to walk in. Touchdown, Alabama. Second time today that on a run, an Alabama player was able to just cruise to the corner. Throws a quick slant, first down throw. And Courtney Davis on the receiving end, brought down by Shaheem Carter. The 36. Mond again got some heat, throws back across his body, and he got it to his tight end. And still running down to the 40 is Jay Sternberger. Davis in motion. The throws out to Corbin. And he's got a nice gain out of that. But pretty high on Corbin, he had. Wow, the pocket somehow held up, and he delivers a strike to Buckley, first down. Keaton Sutherland, number 78. The... Mond sets his feet, throws, and Rodgers has it, but he's short of the first down, or does he have it? There's a battle going on with Sabian Smith, who says he has an interception. The headlinesman says no. 25. The kick is up and again he is good. That's his third of the day. So they needed seven. They only got three. Still in the game though at 38-16. Here four at 17 remaining in the third. An opportunity with good field position for AM. Aggies at their own 42-yard line. Kellen Ma. If there wasn't a holding call, it wouldn't have been a That's sack. That's what I thought, too. And Jennings gets the sack. I, Some extra heat. Mac Wilson's dancing around. I don't know if they need it. Maybe not. They don't. they don't. Down he goes, and it's Isaiah Bugs. Kirk Williams, number 70 and 74. Get great blocks that time, the right side of that line. 
And Williams is, I'll tell you what, he's a big man, but he is way faster than anybody knows. Gets a breather after a 35-yard gain. And there's a jet sweep for Henry Ruggs. Ruggs with blockers in front. And Ruggs down the sideline, stays in bounds. Blockers, goodbye. Mr. Ruggs, touchdown. Well, that takes care of the rushing game. <laughs> I think he stepped out though at the eight. So oh, Josh Jacobs gets the key block here, number eight. Watch that. Key block on the corner. Got then he gets another one. And the cleater. Almost a step out there. Let's see if he does. Uh -huh. Oh, I don't see that's how he stepped. That's that's not my fault there. You made the right call. Mon throws a slant. Nice catch. And a first down to Buckley. Nice hands by Buckley. Their starters have not played a lot of plays. Mon, the heat on the inside, down he goes again. And Dwight, who I just mentioned, and Bugs and Mathis are all there to meet him. At 14. Here comes a blitz, a delayed blitz. A throw is true to Davis. And Courtney Davis with a first down. Looking in the direction of Rodgers, throws it to him. Kendrick Rodgers, another first down, I think, with a forward progress. Brother of Stefan Diggs, a great receiver of the Minnesota Vikings. Mon, look out. Matt Wilson's got him. He throws it as he hits the deck. Yep. No surprise here. You make two first outs gets Alabama. They're, coming. Gonna, they're coming after you. <laughs> Third and ten. Again, Mond is flushed out of the pocket, and uh, that's going to be a horse collar, I think. Well, or not. On a Comes a corner blitz again. Mond gets rid of it, and he's got his tight end again, Sternberger. He had a touchdown catch earlier, and he's got it down to the 10-yard line, maybe the 9. Nice route against Dylan Moss. Second and goal from the 9. Mond quarterback draw. Trying to get to the edge, did. Trying to get to the pylon, and did. Touchdown, AM. I'll tell you, when you beat Dylan Moses that time, number 32, that's a great athlete. And Mod just uh, made Dylan Moses grab air. Field. They fake it to him. Somewhat. Oh, a fumble. Yep. And Najee gets on top of it. It was a similar play to a quarterback draw, quarterback sweep, but AM smelled it out. Pointed if they did. <laughs> There's a, everybody in the country is going, oh, is that something we can like bet on or something? Or whatever? <laughs> I think you can. I think you can bet on anything nowadays. Cameron Buckley with the catch out to the 19. And, you know, of course, the finish, though. Starko throwing out the flat complete. And it's a first down to Jay Shaw Corbin, the freshman. Dylan Moses made the tackle. Starko again complete to Corbin. And Corbin might have another first down. Starko wants to throw a screen, got it complete to Edwin. Edwin got a first down out of it. Mac Wilson and Trayvon Diggs finally tracking down over there with 45 seconds to play. Starko. Throws again, complete underneath to Rodgers. Rodgers stood up by Moses and then buried under a sea of crimson. When Jimbo was the offensive coordinator, it was very similar to this Alabama team in talent. They have some great receivers on that team. Yeah, Michael Clayton, Derby Henderson, Skylar Green, Dwayne Bowe. Final play, here comes a blitz. Starko throws, completes to Buckley. And the clock will oops, stop with one second. Out. Yep. And the fans are going to react to that. Hey, I have no problem with this. If you're going to practice, you might as well practice against the best. You got your backup quarterback in there. I just going to bring four. Starko goes down, and it is over. Fumble recovered by Alabama, and they win it 45 to 23. <laughs> Number 95, Johnny Dwight.